Hey guys, welcome back to my YouTube channel. You guys are awesome and I'm so glad you're here. On this channel, I share with where we share tips and tricks to make your tech life easier. If you like my videos, please smash that like button and leave a comment below. I love reading your comments and seeing what you have to say. And if you're new here, please subscribe and turn on the notification bell so you don't miss any of my future videos. Let us get started. In this video, I'm going to show you how to send personalized bulk emails in Gmail for free using a mail merge add-in called Yet Another Mail Merge. Mail Merge is a feature that allows you to create and send customized emails to multiple recipients at once. For example, if you want to send a promotional email to your customers with their name, email, and product they bought from you, you can use Mail Merge to do that easily. To use Mail Merge in Gmail, you need two things a Google Sheet spreadsheet with your recipient's information and a Gmail draft with your email template. Let me show you how it works. First, you need to create a Google Sheet spreadsheet with your recipient's information. You can either type it manually or import it from Google Contacts or another source. The spreadsheet should have at least one column with the email addresses of your recipients. You can also add other columns with any information you want to use in your email template, such as name, product, date, etc. For example, a spreadsheet here with four columns, name, email, product, and date. These are the customers who bought my online course on how to use Gmail more effectively. Next, you need to create a Gmail draft with your email template. This is the email that you want to send to your recipients. You can write anything you want in the subject and body of the email. To personalize the email with the information from your spreadsheet, you need to use merge tags. Merge tags are placeholders that will be replaced with the corresponding values from your spreadsheet when you send. To use merge tags, you need to type them in curly brackets and match them with the column names in your spreadsheet. Let's compose a new draft. In the to field start typing two open curly brackets. Go back to your sheet and copy email header cell and paste back here and close with two curly brackets for example. I have a Gmail draft here with the subject thank you for buying my course. In the body of the email, I have written. As you can see, I have used four merge tags, name, date, product and email. These match with the column names in my spreadsheet. When I send the email, these merge tags will be replaced with the actual values from my spreadsheet for each recipient. Now that we have our spreadsheet and our Gmail draft ready, we can use yet another mail merge to send. Yet another mail merge is a free Google Sheets add-in that allows you to send bulk emails per day for free using mail merge in Gmail. To install it, go to add-ons. Get add-ons and search for yet another mail merge. Then click install and grant the necessary permissions. Once installed refresh your browser and go back to your spreadsheet and click on add-ons yet another mail merge start mail merge. Here, you need to select your Gmail draft from the drop-down menu. You can also choose whether you want to track opens and clicks for your emails and whether you want to send them as replies or new messages. Then click on Send Emails and wait for yet another mail merge to do its magic. It will send personalized emails to all your recipients using your Gmail draft and your spreadsheet data. You can check the status of your emails by looking at the last column of your spreadsheet called Merge Status. It will show you whether your emails were sent successfully or not. And that's it. 
You have just learned how to send personalized bulk emails in Gmail for free using yet another mail merge. I hope you found this video helpful and if you did, please give it a thumbs up and subscribe to my channel for more tips and tricks. Thanks for watching and see you in the next video.